guys so i'll be doing a quick review of my lashes um the different types of that there are the rest of them i'm guessing um and yeah i hope you guys like it so for this video i will be using the james charles palette and i will be reviewing some of the lashes So I already did my makeup and I did my hair as well um, and now we're gonna go in with the eyelashes okay so I'm gonna go in order on how they're on the website um, the first one we're gonna do is step money um, so it comes in a little plastic oh, kind of messed it up already And the ones that I do use, of course, I'm not gonna sell to you guys, so just so you know. All the ones that I wear are just for me, um, and I keep them separate from the ones I do sell. So we're gonna start with Steph Money. So these are the Steph Money ones. Um, as you can see, they're very wispy, but they do look natural as well. Um, I don't have any mascara on my top lash, just so you know, I did put some on the bottom so you guys could see what the lash actually does without mascara. Um, I love it. It's not super out there, um, it looks natural, but still it gives you that wispy look and full look. So the next one that we're gonna do is gonna be Dramatica. Um, these are some of my favorite ones, so let's see. Alrighty, so these are Dramatica. Again, I am not using mascara on my top lashes. These are some of my favorite ones because they're dramatic and it really brings out personality within them. Um, they're long at the ends and short in the, in the inner corner of the eye so so this is how they look as you can see they're pretty long all right so the next one that we're gonna be using is Christina so let's see how these turn out okay so these are definitely a lot more full um, so they're short but they do have more lashes within its little segment so that's why they look very full but they are short um not nothing compared to the dramatic ones definitely not i feel like these can be kind of um compared to the stuff money ones but these for sure are definitely more full So next up, what we're going to do is we're going to try on the Rosa lashes. Um, these definitely look smaller, but we'll see how they fit. Okay, so these are the Rosa lashes. Um, I named these after my mom. She likes natural lashes that don't really bother her. Um, not too heavy and stuff like that. When she does get like eyelash extensions, she goes for the extra small ones and she said she loved these. So if you guys are looking for any like not, something not too dramatic, um, not too heavy, I do recommend these as far as my mom has told me. These are really pretty um, and they're like not so full that it's heavy, but they look nice. Next up we have Latina lashes, um, so these seem to be very full. Cool. Um, they are big and they're really curly at the ends. They're very full cool and I'm excited to wear these honestly. Um, so it is my first time wearing these so pretty excited. All right, guys, so these were very different from what I expected. They are very curly, but they are not heavy. Um, they're not as full as the other ones that I've tried on and stuff. These are actually really nice. Um, they have less lashes on each set, but it still brings volume. And I don't have mascara 
on my top lashes, so it definitely does justice. The next ones that are, I'm gonna be putting on are the Belladonna ones. Um, these are really, really big. Look at this. Grandissimo. I'm excited to wear them. Let's see what it is. Oh my goodness. These are huge. So I got these for those girls that love huge lashes, but oh my goodness. These are definitely the biggest ones I've worn. Look at this. Están grandísimas. It's like I love it, but I don't know. They're, they're too big. My eyes are not that big. They are huge. These are some lashes to make a freaking statement. And that's what we should do everywhere we go. Anyhow, these are crazy big. Ooh. I might pull up to a party like this. Okay, so I still can't get over the fact that these are humongous, okay? But we gotta keep on going. Um, next up, we have the lashes that are called Serena. Um, Serena's like calm. Um, these lashes are definitely wispy, but they kind of look natural, so. Let's see how they look. Ladies, let me tell y'all, these are so freaking cute. They're not super long, like whenever I was holding them, they were so short, but they're so cute. Look at this. They're very full and wispy, and they look like real lashes, honestly. Doyen. Um, so these lashes do seem very, very long. Not as long as the Belladonna ones, but definitely these are very long and full. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. All right, we'll see how they look. Okay, so these flare at the ends, so it gives you like, uh, like a very, like it gives shape to your eye. They're smaller in the inside and then they flare out. Um, as you can see, they're very full, but not as large as the other ones. All right, so next up we have the Glam Babe lashes. These are longer than these and they're all like, it, do it doesn't flare out, it's just boom. Um, <laughs> it has, like all, like the major length is all throughout the lash and you'll see it whenever they're on. All right, so these are the lashes, the Glam Babe lashes. Kind of long, but they don't flare out like at the end, they just flare out everywhere. And they're also not heavy. So some of them are heavy, if you see like how, um, like how full they are. These are not that heavy because they're not that full. You can use them more than once, just take good care of it, you know, take off the glue and whatnot, but I think you'll be good. These are the last, not the least, right? I love these lashes and I'm not sure what to think about them because when I put them on, they kind of like the Belladonna ones are very full and like very big, but again, with these, the Chingona lashes, you definitely make a statement just like the Belladonna ones. Um, this reminds me of all the women who get up every day, even if they're tired, even if they don't feel like going out to work to get stuff done this really goes out to like the whole line goes out to all those women who 
who keep fighting for another day, another dollar, another meal, and who keep fighting for their children. Um, again, all those women who are leaders, role models, inspired me to fulfill my dreams, to become a businesswoman, and I wouldn't be here without them. I wouldn't be here without my mom. She's brave and she has definitely been through so much and I just want to make her proud. Alright, let's go with the jingle nut lashes. So, here we are. So these are the lashes that are my favorite and I would wear these anywhere I go, honestly. If, you know, si estoy arreglada, of course. Um, but these are lashes that make me feel amazing. Um, they make me feel brave. They make me feel like I want to make something happen in this world type deal. You know, it's, it's kind of corny, but there's a lot of women or people who identify as women um, who put something on that make them feel better. And for me, these lashes make me do that. And I hope one of my lashes, um, if you do buy some, I hope they make you feel some type of way, have an emotional connection to them, or even just a symbol. Um, like I said, these lashes, all the lashes on my line, I named them after very special people in my life people who inspire me and also some of the names mean leader, role model. Um, so yeah, I mean, if you're glamorous and you want to make a difference in the world, why not put some lashes on? Again, let's rule this world with lashes and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. <laughs> I am super excited for all the good things and the bad that come my way, honestly. Um, you do learn from the bad things and you appreciate the good ones, so. Shout out to all those women who get up every day and get shit done. Alright, love you guys.